To write the name for SnOH4, let's first write the name of the metal as it appears on the periodic table. So Sn, that's just tin. Next, we're going to write the name of the polyatomic ion. That's this OH here. So when you have OH bonded to a metal like tin, it's called the hydroxide ion. So you either memorize that this is called the hydroxide ion, or if you're allowed, you look it up on a table of polyatomic ions. So for OH, we write lowercase h. And so far, we have tin hydroxide is the name for SnOH4. But tin, that's a transition metal. So we need to write the charge here in the name. We know that the hydroxide ion, the whole thing, is 1 minus. And we have four of them. So the tin, that has to be 4 plus for the charge to balance out, give us a net charge of 0. So we're going to write a Roman numeral 4 and then put parentheses around it. And the name for SnOH4 is tin-4-hydroxide. If you're given the name here and asked to write the formula, you know the tin is 4 plus, so you'll need four of these hydroxide ions, each one 1 minus, to get a net charge of 0. This is Dr. B with the name for tin-4-hydroxide. Thanks for watching.